Hey, 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 welcome back, guys, to another Spencer TV video. Towin Tuesday, boys. We're doing some towing here on the Gold's Crest Valley winter map. Now, guys, some towing Tuesday. Very, very excited for this. Um, it's kind of, it's not, I want to say it's exactly like towing. I'm, we're towing snowmobiles. That's, that's the thing. A huge, huge blizzard came in last night. And there were a bunch of people snow snowmobiling and stuff like that the night before or like leading up to the big blizzard and they got stuck i think there was a huge accident and they had to like get rescued out of there and they left the snowmobiles all that so that's what we're doing today we're going to pick up their snowmobiles i think a couple are wrecked um we we got the tow bar over there too a couple are going to be wrecked um and we got to be careful with that and we have to load them up onto the pj trailer so what i'm gonna do is okay okay so we we have to get the tow bar and we have to oh by the way guys this truck uh quick shout out to mclean modding um i haven't used this truck before i think i've had it in like my mod section a long time but uh it's a, it's a dually we got a dually cummins i think it's a 2011 you know you got the crew cab look at look at the stacks down here guys i i, I like i really like that exhaust there and then we got the iron cross in the front baby this thing's decked out that's what this is what we're gonna use to uh to go and get the snowmobiles to actually like pull them out i was gonna get um like something bigger like like a tow truck but then i figured that it would get stuck in the snow and it just wouldn't it just wouldn't work so we gotta back up out of here and then the tow bar is right over here we'll go pick it up and then just kind of <clears throat> we'll back it onto our trailer and then just lock the load so we can like bring it along without having to make two trips so that's gonna be super nice here we go hopefully okay i was a little worried about that okay yeah see maybe we're gonna have to come in at an angle because like the end of it is like poking yep the end of it's like poking into the trailer dang it okay we're gonna have to finesse this guys we're gonna absolutely have to finesse this oh okay okay this is sketchy Okay, so we got a last second. Now go straight on. Come on now. See so ya. Yeah, um. Okay, what? Do we have any other plan on how could we get this up? We are literally just destroying the trailer right now. Oh, maybe we can get it now. How could we? How could we get this up there? That's the real question. Okay, let's quickly detach. Can I, I, can I, oh my goodness, guys, can I grab it? Oh my god, oh my goodness. Guys, I could have just grabbed it the whole entire time. Oh, I feel like a scrub. Oh my goodness, we absolutely just wrecked our trailer for nothing, guys, for nothing. Oh my goodness, I'm mad, I am upset. Oh my goodness, okay. We're loaded up. All we have to do is raise up our thing. Lock the load is Y. Oh, is it not? I think it's already locked. Now it's locked. Oh, no, it's not. Now it's locked. Okay, we barely got it on there. Okay, perfect, perfect. Looks like everything's good. I don't know why those went up again. Maybe I accidentally pressed the button. But anyway, we're out on the road. Um, Our first one, our first one, we have one... Um, we had like a buddy of ours just just crashed like real quick um he, he crashed out he was just kind of riding and he crashed guys this all happened last night big this is why there's all all this snow big blizzard came in and these guys had to get out of there because they could not you know they couldn't survive um couldn't survive the blizzard when they crashed their snowmobile so we have to go rescue this quick snowmobile i think it's like it's an older snowmobile my buddy told me um so it shouldn't be too bad we're gonna have to go over the curb that's why we got this bad boy. She's going to be doing a lot of off-roading today. And this PJ trailer, I this is going to come in handy. I think there's about I think there's about five to six snowmobiles um, down, way down there in, in the mountains where a lot of people like the snowmobile went th during winter time. So we're going to quickly... It, it was just this farmer. He wrecked. He, he can't get anything up there. And he doesn't want to get any of his tractors stuck or anything like that. So I okay so here's the trail a lot of people like to ride okay there's a snowmobile okay perfect he described it he said it was right off the trail just like he said right by that water water pump here we go we'll pull around 
let the ramps down and unlock the load which is why yep there we go then yeah we're gonna have to pull it out of there i don't know if it's still working i know he got stuck but i i don't know if he said that he like absolutely just destroyed the snowmobile but yeah like i said it's a little bit oh, i like that i like that kind of look i like the windshield there it, it, that's a nice snowmobile I, I would pick myself up one of those there we go. So the green goes to whatever we're pulling with. And then the see the green stripe right there. You put that on like the tow truck or truck or anything that's going to be doing the pulling. Thing does come in handy quite often. There we go. We'll attach. We are attached to the, to the tow bar. There we go. Get it. Okay. Can we line? There we go. We're right on. That was clean. X to attach. Looks like we're pulling her out real good. Okay. So it was stuck. I didn't even want to mess with trying to start it up and get it unstuck. Then we're going to see if we can just start it up. And if it'll, if it'll kind of idle. I mean, it doesn't have to go 100 miles an hour. Okay, it did start up. It started up real good. And now we just got to kind of walk it on there. There we go. We popped a wheelie. There we are. Okay, let's kind of just scooch it up. Um, We'll take this one quickly back, okay? Because I, I don't think we'll be able to fit every single snowmobile that we're about to pick up on the PJ trailer alone. So instead of taking two trips when we have to take that really far one, we're going to quickly drive back to the shop because this is a quick one. This isn't bad at all. And, uh... And then we'll go pick up the huge... It, it was a group of guys out last night. And they got caught in the snowstorm. One guy crashed. And he got hurt pretty bad. And they didn't know what to do. And they couldn't get home. They didn't have room to like... They didn't have like a shred... You know, they couldn't have like a sled back there to carry him. They just called him in. And they had to leave their snowmobiles behind. That's what we're doing. We're going to pick him up. I believe the load is locked. Is it? No, it's not. Now it should be locked. Yep, it is. Okay. But I just pressed Q. Oh, my goodness, guys. We're rookies. We are rookies out here. We're a bunch of noobs. Probably you guys are watching like, what the heck is TV doing? But anyway, it's going good. We got our first sled on. Not bad. Not bad at all. And I'll see you guys back at the shop. So here we are, guys, rolling up to our parking lot. I'll quickly unload the ramps. Press Y to unlock the load. And we'll get this bad boy out of here. Hopefully no traffic comes. We're going to have to hurry it up real quick. We're kind of blocking the whole entire road. Get the tow bar out of there. Quick. She starts up real good. Very surprised. I think he said he was having trouble starting it up after he got it stuck. Um, And he was trying to like, oh, watch out, man. Oh, we almost hit that business guy. Okay. Let's just, we'll park it right here. He, he'll probably come down to pick it up here shortly. Because everything on it's just fine. That's, that's, that's good to hear. Really good to hear. We can't forget our little tow bar. We're going to be needing a lot of this here. Because there are some absolutely destroyed snowmobiles. Oops, why to X and then why to lock load? See, I don't. Okay, now it's locked. Still trying to figure it out, but look both ways. We'll roll through this stop sign, guys. Spencer TV never stops for it. There we go. I love the iron. Guys, look at that. McLean Mon Iron Cross. The Cummins looks like a beaut. We'll, we'll, I'll be using it more. Um, We got the tool upgrade, and then again, the smoke stacks on down super sick and I got the dually because you know off-roading the more tires the better so it's gonna be up here on our right or excuse me up on our left underneath the Pacific or the Gold Crush Pacific Grand okay okay perfect we'll die we'll slip right past this car everybody's driving slow because the snow and they got poopy cars but not us boys we we're, we're just shredding the snow even with the trailer there we go we'll wait for this car to pass and then to the left down there, guys, these are the most popular, the most popular snowboarding around in Goldcrest. Goldcrest is a huge, er, sorry, snowmobiling. I think I just said snowboarding. Um, but anyway, ooh, the water isn't even, the, the river isn't even, I guess it's moving water, so it's kind of hard to freeze. But here we go. We're pulling in. We're going to leave. Okay. We're going to make sure. We're, okay, there's some snowmobiles right up there. It looks like one's just absolutely destroyed. We'll lower the ramp. Unlock the load. There we go. Hop out real quick. Grab the tow bar. Toss it off. 
Uh-oh. There we go. Beautiful. Let it go. Nice. Detach. And then we'll attach to the tow bar. Get after it, boys. Can I attach to it reverse? Because it looks like... <clears throat> it looks like the green. Oh, yeah. No, we can't. We cannot. Okay, we got to flip it around real quick. Get up there. Get the tow bar. Yeah, and some of the guys, some of these snowmobiles are fine. Like, they're totally fine, but I think those guys just one of them pulled out of here. One of them towed out of here because they were worried. Their buddy's in the hospital. See, I'll show you guys. I don't know if it was this one. Maybe this guy got hurt here. Let's check it out. It looks like those two are fine. That one's a little sketchy. But I think right here, somebody hit this rock. And just whoom. He's gone. He's gone. I don't know. I really don't. I'm just trying to uh, infer kind of what happened. It looks like they said they were more down the road towards the, towards the lo like little cabin thing. What's over here? Okay. That's not good. Oh, my. It was me. I let the dogs out. Oh, they're repping the squad, too. Oh, they're repping the squad. I oh, another one right there. At least these guys know what to ride on. Anyway, we're tapping around. We'll hop in our little Cummins here. Pull. I, I, let's see if this one's fine. I think, yeah, like I said, I think somebody just pulled up here. Like somebody who was fine. One of the buddies and uh, was helping out with the injured guy. But I know that's not this, the Articat over there is absolutely destroyed. We'll put this up here. Maybe I should go reverse. Just, no. I want to make sure we have a bunch of room. We can probably fit another one on the right side. A smaller one. Okay, so we can't bring another player's rush next to that. That's for sure. Maybe we'll take the broken down one. Okay, so top in our Cummins. Make sure the lights are on so we can see good. There we go. Okay. Now we're going to... Oh, I think I just scraped the Iron Cross. No, I scraped the Iron Cross. Okay, so that's pretty close to the hitch. We attach. Oh, my goodness. This thing is light. Okay, it's off. It's off the rock. That's good to see. We'll kind of slowly walk it out. There we go. Because these things... I mean, look at how tiny the snowmobile. It looks like it's a long track, so... That's pretty neat. A little more expensive of a snowmobile, I would say. Kind of meant for, like... For, like, climbing big mountains and stuff. When you have that, like, extra length on the track there. Okay, how are we going to do this now? Um... Let's see. Oh my goodness, we just slapped it sideways. Let's see if we can back it up. I doubt we can do this. Yeah, there's no way. Okay, yeah, there's no way. Let me detach. Quickly. Let me... Okay, you, when you hop on the snowmobile, it did start up. That's good to see. But I doubt, like, the steering. There we go. Maybe? Okay, let, let's try something. Let's try something. Maybe we can get this... The players rush because I I think it'll start in like inch but the guy said there's like no acceleration no power in the engine he absolutely wrecked it on as you guys saw on that rock yeah that would be so scary you just hit a rock I mean you're on a snowmobile it's like hitting a culvert and that snowmobile stops and your body just keeps going there's no stop it there's no seatbelt on snowmobiles there we go oh this thing's got some little power in her Pull back uh right there okay we're attached maybe we can do it like this don't tip on me maybe we can kind of drag her up come on now players rush we're spinning on the wood we're spinning on the pj trailer there we go she's getting oh we had it go players rush okay maybe we need some more speed I think speed's what we need, boys. There we go. We're up. Awesome. Oh, we just... Oh. Okay. Now we'll detach from that. Throw the tow bar out. Tracks are on. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So it does... It does kind of inch its way along. The guy said, like, hey, you're going to have to be careful with some of these snowmobiles. They're a little damaged. They said they'll fix them up, so that, that's good to hear. Good to hear they're going to fix them up. 
probably for the friend who like got bent. I think he's okay. I think he's okay though. He's not like gone or anything. There we go. Let's grab the toe. Little toe bar. Toss her over. There we go. Perfect. Let's tab around. I think this one's fine. We'll get this one out of here. Yeah, this one, I mean, it looked totally fine. Yeah, see, the the two the two rushes, whoever, whoever we're driving. Okay, maybe we should leave this for one of the last ones. And I think the one that hit the tree is stuck as well. Okay, let's whip it around real quick. Don't want to hit that little, like, water well or trough, if you would like to call it that. Let's take a right here. Let's get the Cummins working, plowing through that snow. This is nothing for the Cummins. Almost snow. Oh my goodness. Let's not pull another whatever those guys did. Okay, there we go. It's right up here. There she is. There's a little Arctic cat. Uh, yeah, this is the the other one was the Yamaha. This is the Arctic cat. There we go. Get her out of that tree. Beautiful. There we are. Okay, let's floor it out of here there we go snowmobiles on there good that's good to see and I think it's our these trails get kind of confusing there's a lot of like little little side trails little hits that you can do but this is the like most popular spot for uh I think this is a logging site in like the summer and the fall and the spring but I think this is the most popular site for for snowmobiling in the winter that's pretty cool we'll detach there real quick okay We'll go get, I think it's the last one. I think this is a, uh, another trail. Another trail one. Not sure though. Not, oh, big cat. Oh my goodness. McLean modding. Quick little shout out to my man. There we go. I, we're going to have to be using this truck more often. I, I wish there was like a non do I wish you could kind of switch up duly, non duly. Single tired. That's all right. Oh my goodness. What happened here? Took down a tree, boys. He took down a tree. What a beast. Okay, let's get these branches out of the way. We'll kind of clean up the little mess they made. I don't... We won't... We're going to have to cut off this wood. They're having us do some logging, boys. They're having us cut some wood for them. Okay, there we go. Maybe that's what, the, that's what they were trying to do. They were trying to get some firewood. I don't know. Can we grab it? Beautiful. Oh, we can literally, like, scooch the whole entire log out. Look at that. There we go. Okay. Hop in. Back up. Try not to hit that wood. Don't want to mess up. Okay, we hit it. Oh, well. And red right on. X to detach. She ripped right at. Oh, watch the wood. There we go. Okay, perfect. Perfect. It, yeah, that tree was not too big. Thank God. There we are. Okay. So we must have just been flying through here. Like, went right around that little hut cabin, uh, like, whatever you want to call that, uh, shelter, and just sent it right into a tree. But, that's what happens. Stonebeals dangerous, dangerous sport. So, you know what happens to the best of us? I used to ride Stonebeals as well. I don't think I ever crashed. But, I, I, I bet I came, <coughs> I bet I came close many times. Okay, so here's our little sp spot right here. We'll get them all loaded up. Here we go, we'll detach and then load them all up. Alright, there we go guys, we got them all loaded up. We're gonna quickly grab the tow bar, detach from it, and then throw it into the back of the trailer. And yeah guys, this is gonna wrap up the the our 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 second ever Towing Tuesday video, guys. Make sure to smash that like button if you did enjoy. We're just gonna be taking these bad boys back to the shop. Getting them looked at, getting them uh, back to the rightful owners, and uh, I'm sure they'll be here to pick it up in a couple of days or so. Um, it, it, it was a big, big night for them, you could say. Just a, a group of five guys, just ab two of them got hurt, and then thank, thank God they 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 were able to call in, and then people rescued them before it got too bad. There we go. We locked the load. Is why. Then yeah, guys, this is gonna end the video. Hopefully you did enjoy. Make sure to smash the like button. Like I said. I'll see you guys in the comment section. Peace.